Hi, I'm Captain Doug Stanford with Texas Fish Tips. It's your weekly fishing report. Well, hello, boys and girls. We're catching some redfish out here in island number one, island number two, number three. Uh, there's been redfish all in this whole area. Uh, we're just using cut menhaden, uh, cut mullet. Either one works pretty good. You can drift through with a popping cork or shrimp if you want to. There is a few trout mixed in there as well. But these little islands right down through here, they're holding some redfish as well. Anywhere as long down through here has been doing real well catching those redfish on cut mullet or cut menhaden. Well, right down Harbor Island, right down this area, uh, we can catch a lot of sheep's head. There's some reds in there. We caught some up to 30 inches, all on shrimp. There's a few black drum mixed in there and occasional flounder. Uh, all along these rocks, we're not throwing in that middle of that channel, we're throwing along those rocks, about seven, eight, ten foot of water. Uh, just anywhere down through there, you can tap those pylons, uh, no big deal, and it makes it easy on you. You can also go around the end of the Phoenix docks right down through here. Watch those big piles sticking up out of the water out of there. But there is some good fish right next to that wall. Uh, about 20 to 25 foot of water. Or you can cast a popping cork right up on top of it. Or a free line shrimp. Um, and just let it float down. Kind of stair step it down. But there is some good fish. We caught some nice reds the other day. Uh, some of them was 27, 28 inch. They was perfect tournament reds right in that area. Also, if you get on down here in front of Klein's Landing... This whole area down through all these rocks has been holding some nice redfish. A few nice trout, but that's when the water's not too strong. Uh, we can catch them mainly on shrimp, but you can catch them on cut mullet and cut menhane as well. Get on the end of those jetties. That south jetty especially. We've been catching some sheep's head up to 10 pounds out there. Uh, pompano, sheep's head, reds, bull reds. Uh, you name it, just about everything's out there. We even caught some mangrove snapper out there, all on live shrimp. We'll start down around these piers right here. This especially, you don't even have to have a boat. Get on it. It's at uh, Indian Point Pier. It's a good pier. There's been some nice trout. There's been some reds caught off it. Big black drum. Just about everything in the world, and they catch them on shrimp. But like I said, you don't even need a boat. Get on there and get after it. Also, these pilings right here, these old piers, some of these good piers, some of the old pilings, either one. But they're holding sheep's head, they're holding black drum, and they're holding redfish. If you use shrimp, you're going to catch them all. Uh, you'll catch a lot of small trout and a lot of small reds along the way and some ladyfish. If you catch a ladyfish, cut it up. Throw it in here for these redfish and they'll chew on it. Uh, but the black drum, they like the shrimp. Whether it's dead or alive or crab fish bites, they like them all of it. But there's been some good black drum down through. There's a lot of small ones mixed in. So you just keep on and it's a lot of fun. But there is some good fish to be had. Get over these rocks and through Ingleside, all down through. There's been holding some nice redfish and a few trout all on shrimp. All right, be careful over in Ingleside. There's that island they're building right in here. Some of those dredge lines and there's all kinds of stuff mixed up going on. But be careful of this area. Also, right around here, right by old Cook's Island in this area, there's been holding some nice redfish. Cut mullet, cut menhaden has been the way to go. Those shrimp in there, you'll probably get a bunch of sand trout and small specks, but there is good fish in there mixed in with it. And a few black drum. Uh, this whole bank's been holding black drum right down through here on shrimp. Uh, also, we're catching redfish with the shrimp and catching mullet. Or catch a mullet, cut them up, put them in the potholes. That's where the reds are. Anywhere down through has been holding some nice redfish. Especially this little point right down here, but be careful. There is some dredge equipment. You can get in behind it. Be careful. But nobody seems to be fishing it, but there has been some good fish in there. Uh, this bank right down through here, this grassy bank, find you a pothole. Uh, pull up in there, throw in about two foot of water. There's been some nice redfish. They like a cut mullet, cut menhaden. Some of these docks down through here, we've been using shrimp. We've been catching some black drum just mixed up in down through there. Try not to tie up to them, but you can use your trolling motor and hang out in front of them. But we've been catching that, and we've also been catching some mangrove snappers, some keepers, too, uh, on shrimp right down through here. Thanks for watching. I'm Captain Doug Stanford.